Hello you, welcome to Geekism. This is Trax, the uh, toy train simulator game mod, something like that. Uh, this is an absolutely adorable little title that came out a couple of days ago, relatively quietly on Steam. Uh, it was based originally on a Game Jam project uh, that they've now sort of put together into a full release. And while everyone else is playing Airport CEO and kind of banging their heads against a brick wall with that one, uh, personally, I, uh, I thought I could play something a little cuter, a little bit more fun, uh, in my opinion. Anyway, I've actually had a little play of this already just to see if it was actually suitable for the channel and uh, oh man this is just a nostalgia trip now this is basically a train simulator uh, but it's designed around the the wooden train sets that pretty much everyone in the world ever uh, had as a kid you see the piece there look with a little jigsaw on the end of it like that and uh, it's really really sweet there is a game somewhere in there where you have to go around and pick up passengers uh, but to be honest with you I'm just quite enjoying playing free play and building something that looks quite cool so that's what we're gonna do uh, we're gonna go into play there's been a little updates this week so I'm just gonna um have a look if we can uh let here we go level select we want to do free play yeah yeah the uh, free play on clear yeah okay play yeah okay cool so um there is a tutorial that i've already done so that shouldn't really be popping up but basically this gives us a real large open space uh to work with and we can come in here we can zoom in and out uh zooming in and out also uh, affects the uh, the height of that as well, so we'll, we will adjust that. But for now, let's uh, let's build here, 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 and then we can put a station here. So if I remember rightly, it's G uh, to unlock everything, and we can um, we can also unlock all of this stuff as well. In the in the um, in the game version of this, we uh, we have to spend money to unlock these, but because this is free play, uh, this has actually been patched in today, yesterday. Uh, we couldn't do that so but we're gonna we've got lots of different things see all these things here they, they're all part of the uh, the main game for uh, you know sending around different things okay so we've got we just want to unlock it all and make the place look pretty so we've got lots of different trees as well um, yeah right right hold right mouse button and drag to pull row sideways oh, okay uh, no yeah the last couple of these. Music's very sweet as well, sort of, you know, very chilled out kind of uh, bit of music that I think's pretty good. Uh, here we go. We've somehow ended up with loads of stuff here, so I think if we press C when we're hovered over stuff. No, is that alright? Uh, no, it's just getting rid of everything, isn't it? What have we done here then? I don't. Well, I mean, I guess we do want a station, but. That wasn't what I was going to do, but you know, that's fine. We can have a station there. So we've got a cool station then. Um, that is going to be our first major station. So we're going to come out a little bit now. And we'll go uh, around. This is cute. This is really, really sweet. So we can do... Let's do... Let's go out a little bit further. And let's just get a bit of basic tracking going. We're going to go back on ourselves here. Because I want to see what happens when we try and put a bridge over the top. There we go. I'm back down again. Yeah, look at that. I used to have so much satisfaction doing that as a kid. I hope that I, I haven't just kind of made up the fact that this is like a thing, you know? Like, I, I'm sure like everyone had these. I'm sure they're really, really common. Uh, at this point, we can put in a special type of track. If we hold down Alt, uh, we can do something like this or, uh, or something like that. So let's do, let's bring it around a little bit further actually for now. And um, I don't really want to go back on myself there. Let's try that way. There we go. That's what I want to do. Um, and now I'd like to come to edit from here. There we go. And come off that way. There we go. Yeah, that's what I want to do. Can we not do that? Well, oh, it doesn't seem to like that one, does it? Let's just get rid of this tutorial. It's bothering me ever so slightly. Press C to clear your current piece. Press the left muscle track to socket. You may find that you can't select a socket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Q and E and mouse wheel. Yeah, T to switch between train and build mode. We'll do that later on. Hold T. The train doesn't have to run on the tracks at all time. Open G for the toy box. Dear, 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 dear. Okay, there's lots going on, but um, we're not too fussed about that. 
I'd like to build that piece. It doesn't seem to be a thing we can do, but we can do that. That's fine. So we'll have one going this way. And this can be a bit of a countryside go, this one. Um, let's bring you up. So let's, let's have a longer, longer, uh, what's the word? Bridge. Uh, I can think of the word bridge then, ladies and gentlemen. That's what, uh, what happened there. And uh, one more. And then I want to come here. And then we'll clear the piece we're on and carry on from this and join them back up there. Yeah, there we go. Lovely. We've got a couple of cool little intersections now. We're going to take you to there. But I want to come back here and, and, and come off this way. There we go. And let's go. Let's go a bit of a windy road there. That would be that would be quite cool. That's the sort of stuff when you you do when you when you're starting to run out of uh, <laughs> starting to run out of bricks. You're starting to run out of the pieces. Oh, this is so satisfying. We're gonna come this way. So one of the one of the sort of game genres I've never really played much of is the kind of uh, is the train simulator. It's something I was talking about with. Um, uh, Vanilla PC Strategy is a great channel, by the way. I'll, I'll pop a link in the description if I remember. He plays. Um, he plays lots of it's like look at this time since last save it's reminding me i haven't saved uh, he plays lots of strategy games um using the base game always so like no mods um he's really good really satisfying he's currently playing um airport ceo but i was watching him play a little bit of machinki i think uh, which was a train simulator that did pretty well last week or two um and it's just something i've never really been that into but i i can see myself maybe having a go look at that there is our little train track how cool does that look um so let's start making it look uh, look pretty. We've got um, we need a normal station, and we're gonna have a we're gonna have a normal station up here. Uh, no, that's gonna be countryside, isn't it? So let's have a normal station over here. There we go, and then we can have uh, a platform. Is what we want over here. This is gonna be our countryside. So um, I can't remember the key for rotating stuff. Uh, R, yeah, it's R. Um, so let's have you. Uh, let's have you on the outside. There, there we go. And that's for uh, where it will collect people in the main game. You have a, a place to. What's wedding station? Oh, wedding station looks great. Okay, so this is going to be our business quarter. That's going to be a little town over here. This is going to be our main town. So actually, we're gonna we're gonna extend our path here a little bit. Our uh, our track into, oh no, I didn't want to do that, into quite a, a larger area like that, there we go. And then now we've got a great um, a great sort of kick-off kick point here. No, it just doesn't want to do that piece, does it? I, would, I could have sworn that was a piece in the game. What about if we uh, cancel it? And we do our uh, What's our alt piece? No, 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 there we go. Alt piece gives us one of them. I mean, we can actually, we could use that. So we could come here, we could do that. Yeah, there we go. Alt. And back out again. Alt. And then we could come up this way. Oh, yeah, look at these bit. Interchanges. Um, no, 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 you were, you were okay there. Let's carry on you. Yeah, now I want to come to here and join you. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, neat. Okay, where else could we stick one of those? Where could we join stuff up a little? Um, I kind of feel like you should be connected there as well. No? Yeah. Yeah, we have only, we've only got one little bridge. But I'm okay with that. I, we, I know we can't do water, but we've got a bridge over there as well. Okay, cool. So here, this can be our... Um, uh, wedding station. This this is going to be the town basically. So let's um, let's rotate you. There we go. And we'll place you. Oh, it's a little bit annoying that we're not centered there. We're going to have to fix that because I know that's the sort of thing that's going to bother us. Um, there we go. So we'll put you to there, and then we'll just straighten you up one. There we go. And round. And now. We can uh, we can put you in and you'll be lovely and centered. Yes, there we go. Beautifully done. Okay, let's zoom in a little bit. We're going to start with our city then. Uh, this is going to be our town. So what have we got? We can do uh, interactive. I'm pretty sure these interactive pieces they 
they do stuff. They, um, they like when the train goes past, things happen. Um, terrain block. That's just that just gives us a bit of oh, that just gives us a bit of height. That's interesting. We could maybe do some height stuff over there later on, sort of like rolling hills. Booster. I have no idea what that does. I guess it speeds us up. Speed check. Is this going to tell us to go slow? Oh, yeah. So we need one of these coming into the station, don't we? So have one there. And we'll have another one on this side. There we go. Because we have to slow down as we get into the station, don't we? Oh, it's a little bit out. But we can put it in correctly. Let's have a look how distance have we done. About that. We're not going to take too long on this because this is going to be a one-off video. We're not doing a full series on this thing. I just really wanted to share it with you. Um, so let's have a look. We've got some tall houses that we can come up here. There was a way. There was a way of shrinking the uh, the this one and two change grid placement size. There we go. Uh, oh, we're already. Oh, we, oh, we can go even. Oh, we can do free build. Oh, wow, awesome. Okay, I don't want to go completely free build actually. So let's let's up you just a little. Let's go to there. So here's the station. And we'll have two of these big ones here. And then we'll have a medium house next to them. And there we go. And we'll do one on the other side as well. So uh, one thing I've noticed straight away is uh, colour variation would, would be kind of nice here, I think. Let's have a... Whoops. Let's have a couple of... We've got some nice fountains as well. Oh, and a clock tower. So here can be our, our town centre. Um, although we're going to have to... Oh, no, that's right. There we go. You can be in the middle. So we'll put down our clock tower in the middle of the town. Um, yeah, some, uh, some slight colour variations on these would be pretty neat, I think. So we'll put you. You're gonna back up onto the, onto the uh, the train track there. So three of you this side, and on this side we'll have a few as well. This is that's like the high street that is. That's where that's where they're gonna get shops from. Uh, we'll back you up one there. Ooh, let's make sure it's lined up. It's gonna bother me if it isn't. There, but this time we're actually gonna have a slightly larger house here. So we'll have a medium house. In there like that. In fact, let's knock it back just a little. Yeah, that looks good. Because if we can't have variation with colour, we can at least have variation with there. Uh, with oh, what on earth just happened then? Tiniest bit of track just went. So left click is always getting rid of track. Okay. So how do we get rid of pieces? There we go. With C on them. Right. Okay. Cool. Uh, so let's do a medium house there. Like. Oh, there. Let's just have it slightly off. Okay, so here's our town. Our town's looking a little bit grim. We need some. We need some uh, foliage in our town, which I'm sure we can do. With we have trees. Oh, look at these adorable little trees. Um, let's up the boxes a little here, and we'll do a nice little run of them. There we go. There, and let's see what tree two looks like. We've got something, we could do something that's a little bigger. They're all sort of smaller ones, aren't they? So, okay, well, if they're all smaller, that's fine. We'll do these ones a little bit more random. Like so. And I've gone into train mode. We're not worried about that just yet. We want to build something for the train to go past first, don't we? And then we can have some little ones here. It's got a nice, nice, rather nice back, large back garden this house has got here. That's pretty good. All right, what else have we got? Let's um, lampo. Oh yeah, we need lampposts in our uh, in our town, don't we? So we'll we'll put a little high street here. So we want a lamp there, and one there, and one there. Just realise there's no way up to that station. I guess they come through the uh, the back of it. That's fine. Oh, we can go on top of stuff. That's weird. There we go. What have I done wrong there? I've put those wrong, haven't I? Let's have another go at that. Uh, where are they? Lamppost 1 we use there. We'll use lamppost 2 somewhere else. We've got a bit of variation. There we go. And there. There we go. The lampposts are in place. Uh, wall. Oh, the wall's nice, isn't it? Um, I feel like we should have uh, some wall up the side of the city there 
There we go. Oops. There. And there. And there. And then we'll have you going in. Any any like any game like this that just allows clipping straight away, it's just great. Like they, they understand what we want to do with this game. They understand that we want to play and we want to make things look pretty. And we don't necessarily mind about limitations. I think that's a that's a big key thing with this kind of game. Is that limita limitations are not meant to be uh, a thing. There we go. Look at that. We put a little town square. I like it. I feel like uh, this space here is perfect for a fountain. So, oh, this one's a little big. I think I feel like that might be getting a bit too close to the to the track. I'm hoping this one is a little smaller. Uh, it is perfect. So that will fit just there. And we could probably have. Oh my god! I keep pressing that button. We could probably have uh, the larger one here. And it would look pretty good, I think. So let's just knock you out a little bit there. Oh yeah, I like that a lot. I feel like we need some trees along the back of the head, the back of the houses here, so that we're not getting crazy um, noise coming from the train. So let's do a little nice row of topiary. That's good. I don't want to know what the stain is on the back of all the houses. I don't. I really don't want to know where that's coming from at all. Although it's not something that interests me right now. Uh, there we go. There's our town. So a town is the first one here. This station. Um, we've got a little bit of a crossroads there. Uh, no, it's done it again. Look. No, there. Um, so this station. This is going to be our business quarter. So let's put some business in. Business station. Business spawn. I don't really know what that is. Um, so we've got collect and deposit. Uh, so have we, have we haven't really got random. Ah, is random what we wanted? Oh, random does all different colours look. Okay, we need to go back over and fix this. I'm sorry. Let's, uh, let's get rid of all these. And as lovely as you are, folks, we do want a bit of colour col variation in our town. So we're going to get rid of all of you. And you and you, there we go. And you and you, and we'll try that again. But you using, oops, using uh, random house, and we'll knock you down a bit. There we go. So one there, one. Oh yeah, that's much better. One uh, there. Oh, you're not gonna let me put you down there because of that stupid fence. That what I've just said about limitations is actually. Not true. <laughs> there. Uh, oh, another big one. We don't want a big one there, do we? Let's let's uh, let's rotate you. Put you there instead. There we go. And a little one. Little one. Oops. Need to get rid of that. Oh, we might not even get a little one there. Let's have a look. See what we get. No, another big one. Okay, that's fine. We the 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 there can be taller ones in the town. Uh, rotate. There we go. Oh, another big one. Wow. Okay, the town centre's increased massively in size since. Uh, since we first started building here. Uh, oh, that one's okay. That's that's a little, 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 little. Oh, there we go. Much better. Now we've got some variation. I like it a lot. And we've got a little house. Well, I'll tell you what, then. We'll have a couple of little houses just on the way out of town. Little sort of farm houses, you know, uh, doing their thing. Uh, I'll tell you what we could also do as well is put them down and, until we get one that we like. There we go. So... Let's turn you around that way. There we go. And then we can get rid of you and you. Good. Uh, so over here then, business-wise, there actually isn't that much. Um, we can do... Uh, we can... Boxes, what are you? Oh, you're strange. Uh, this is like a genuinely random row of boxes. Corkscrew. Oh, wow. Actual corkscrew piece. That's interesting. Block tower. Here we go. I think this is... So these are... these. Oh, look. They actually do wobble. Um, I think if you put them over the track, the train will knock them over when we get to that point. But, um, but for now, we're just going to have... Oh, my God. That's fantastic. We're going to leave them there. <laughs> uh, collect. I don't really know what you are, but you're going to be kind of important here. And... We're going to have a deposit as well. Not too sure what you're asking me to 
collect and deposit. Well, there we go. There's our business area. All right, there's not much we can put in business area. Over here, um, this is going to be our... Uh, our um, what do the lampposts look like? Oh, the other lamppost really posh. Uh, it's going to be our uh, forestry, forestry area. So uh, we need to just make a forest here. Um, over here. So this is where you get off if you want to, for some reason, come to the forest. There we go. And then we'll do a bit of number three, three as well. Like this. There we go. Get a nice dense forest going on here. And oops. These are really really posh, naturally forming trees, these ones are. These these naturally naturally forming topiaries. Uh, it's a fantastic sight to see. And tree one. This is yeah, this is here's the one we we should really put down. These are these are your pine trees. These are your pine wood hills trees, aren't they? Uh, there we go. There we go. That one's gonna be a bit of a problem there. We can we might have to get rid of you. Don't want you to have trash crash the uh, the train. So there we go, we've got the forest. So over here, this last one, I mean, this can be just like a little village, I think. So let's go to small house, and we'll put a few small houses down. Um, like this. And we'll have them quite close to the track, because although that is ridiculous, and you would not want to live there, um, you know, all, all, all we really want to do is have them viewable from when we ride the train later on. Um, let's go back to random house and hope we get a few small ones we do. There's one. Um, let's put the ones that we don't want here out of the way for a minute. Uh, there we go. There we go. Another small one. That's great. I'll have you there. Uh, oh, another small one. Perfect. That should probably. Be. Oh, another small one. Well, I won't. I won't say no. We can have some neighbours. Um, here, I, I feel like we need a couple of buildings here, even though they're not really. You know, that can be like the station master's house. Okay, and then we'll finish off with a little bit more rare, uh, a little bit more of the wall around this area, I think. Here we go. Oops. We are not quite going to make it there, are you? Can I do that? I can. It's a bit funky, but that's okay. The industrial area most definitely needs to be surrounded by wall. I mean, it's just a safety thing, folks, you know. It's just something that we've got to do to stay safe. Uh, one there, one there, one there. Especially with those ridiculously uh, palleted up pallets there. They're, they're far too high. There is no OSHA that that would pass. There is no health and safety that would let that through, I guarantee it. Um, okay, let's do the same here. Uh, and a bit of a bodge, but it's okay. It's all good. There we go. Okay, let's put some uh, let's put some cat let's put some a few plants down over here just because this is a bit villagey, you see. So this would have a lot of greenery around, I think. There we go. And this is the little village station over here, where if you live in the village, you're gonna stop off. You can get on the station here. You can go over to the big city. <laughs> Do you know what? I genuinely my, that my heart is just full of nostalgia for this game. Uh, not quite ready yet. This is this is my childhood. Was playing with one of these sets of trains. I absolutely adored it. Um, let's do some nice uh, nice bit of bush bushwork. Hashtag bushwork. If in doubt, pull the trees out. This is something that pretty much runs across every game we play, doesn't it? Let's be honest with you. We, if in doubt, pull the trees out. Um, I want to go back to that tall one. Very sort of natural looking tree. Uh, oh, we've made an upside down ice cream over there. That's fine. I'm gonna leave it. That'd be a nice little there. Uh, uh, nice little Easter egg. Uh, right, okay. So we'll do a couple more around the back of here and here. And I would say we've got a pretty awesome train set. Look at that. Okay, so where we can ride the train now. Uh, but first of all, we need to put some carriages on it. We don't have to, but I want to. Um, where are they? Uh, passenger, passenger carriage. Now we put them here. There we go. And we can do another one. Yeah. Is it going to figure itself out how it does it? Looks like it. Okay, then we get into the train. So now we can actually ride the train. We're going to push forward. I think space is stop. Yeah, space is stop. Okay, so we're heading out 
from the station. It's a pretty looking little game, this. Look at this. Okay, we're going to go under the bridge. I'm hoping we're not going to crash. No, we made it through the bridge. That's good. We're going to go past our first little house. And we're going to come up uh, past the fountain. Look at that. Particle effects and everything. And uh, we're going to take the... Uh... Oh, we're not going to go into the city. Uh-oh. Have we done some bad, bad planning here? Do we have to... Uh... We might have to go the long way around. Okay, well, that's fine. That's fine. We're going to go to the village first of all then. So over our bridge. Please tell me we can get into the village. Uh, no. Oh, we should have gone right there. That's okay. We'll go this way instead. So we can go left here. So you can pick which way you go just by sort of steering into it. So we're going to go left and we're going to go around the forest instead. Uh, this is where the stream is, I imagine. You know, that'd be nice. Terrain tools would be cool. Just simple terrain stuff. You can paint the... the paint the... Paint... Uh, water or whatever so we're going to come in to uh to the station we're going to ease it up a little because we don't want to go too fast into the station we'll, we'll stop here and see if anyone wants to get on anyone want to get on no because there's no people on here it's free play but like i say in the main game the little dudes they they puddle on and uh, and you have to take them places you know it's sort of like a pick up and drop off very standard oh we're going to some speed up here now we're going to head over here into the uh where we're we going uh we're going oh wow we need to ease up a little bit we need to go right here okay so now we're going into the village Okay, we're actually bombing it through the village. But from here, we should... Which way are we going to head now? Now, we, this way, we, rather than going left to the forest, we're going to go straight on and find our way into the city, I hope. Left here. That's it, straight on here. And there we go. Now we're going to make our way through the city. Past these beautiful walls, look. Um, oh, well, that sign said something different then. Were we going a bit quick, were we? I don't know, but there's the church. Church station. All aboard. Direct route to the industrial zone. Here we go. Let's get some speed up here. Let's see how quick we can really go. And of course, as well, if we uh, if we put if we stop going here, we go get a little bit of speed up. We can come out of this, and uh, and the train will actually just carry on. It'll just. I think it randomly picks which way it's going. I'm not too sure, to be honest, but it just sort of does a little bit of mill, mill about. But look at that. How cute. So are we doing a full series on this? No. You've kind of seen everything. Am I going to keep playing it? Probably not. Have I had a really great nostalgic-filled half an hour playing this? Most certainly I have. I hope you have as well. Like I say, I hope this set is something that uh, you know rings a bell with you as a kid. Do I ever see this being a full game? I I, I don't know. It's it's a cute little demo. Um, you know, maybe the maybe the single player, the, the actual campaign game will 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 get sort of filled out. At the moment, it's uh, it is really quite simplistic. But I've enjoyed playing around. Uh, like I say, you can place these on. I'll show you. There's a there's a level select. Uh, we can save. Um, uh, here we go. Ro we'll open this ro roller coaster. This is set in um, in a modern apartment. Uh, if you choose to load it, the train could start at a different location. That's fine. I don't mind. So load it then. Oh, okay, I'll load this one. Uh, play. Okay, so here's a little video. So here's the one that they built. Uh, which is pretty nice actually. A nice bit of walling around the clock tower there. I mean, it's not as uh, grandiose as our own, obviously, but you know, there's, there's quite a bit of detail you can do. Look, you put little hedges, built little hedges with the uh, with the trees. I was really hoping uh, level select. Let's see if we can do it. Modern apartments, continue, and then from here we should be able to load the save um, that's built in the roller coaster one. There we go. So this just this is kind of crazy. This one, uh, play. Okay, so passengers will appear around the room, open the toy box and drop them off, you see. So what they can do is they'll show you, look, wee. There are now passengers sitting uh, on here. So what we could do is you build a station and you go and pick them up and you drop them off at that station over there. Um, there you go, pa pa drop them off to proceed. Uh, but this uses actually a complete building that they've already done. So you can play here, so it looks like you're playing a little bit more in a real life situation. And you have to use all these crazy hills here, but... Uh, but overall, it's cute. Like I say, it's not a full game yet. Can't see myself playing much more of it, but I was hoping uh, that it was something that you would enjoy at least for a little half an hour. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please give us a like. It really does help out the channel. And if you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. Any thoughts, queries, or suggestions, pop them down in the comments. And if you fancy chat, you can find me on Twitter. I'm at John T. Sparrow. If you want to join in with the Geekism community, you can do so over on our Discord server. You'll find the link in the description. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you in the next one.